Usually it's the air conditioner, but today it's me. No, it's, it's going to come up in the pod. I apologise in advance. Hello! Welcome to the Cowboy for Game Media podcast. Tonight, I'm joined by Bragg. Hello. And Ben from Nolan TCG. Hello. And I'm Jake. Because I feel like I need to say that so my name can come up down here somewhere. Uh, how's... I don't know which side it comes on. Um, how's that working, you, Gary? Let's start with Ben. <laughs> you fucking child. <laughs> you absolute child. As soon as what? I said it. <laughs> well, uh, my week in you, Gary, was fine. I uh, went to locals again. Like Yay. normal. I went 3 1 tonight. It was a very big locals tonight. It was massive. It was very big locals. Like, our local numbers plus like five just rocked up from like some like, random Sydney store. Literally everyone who comes to locals except Bragg and then some people from Sydney. In fairness, Bragg would have hated it. Oh yeah, it was so fucking crowded. And then the air conditioning broke at the start of the night. <laughs> Just <laughs> when, when you said all a, the locals to skip. Yeah, when you said there's a few people there, I'm like, oh, like a hey, obviously, that's a bit uncomfortable. But also, it's like oh, it would have been good practice pre um, regionals. So yeah, but no aircon, no brag. Yeah, Logan just decided yeah. to oh plug yeah everything into one PowerPoint and it just went yeah. So Ben had well actually in fairness Logan had his thing set up there first, yeah. but we didn't know about this issue. Apparently there'd been a water leak and it went made the electricals a bit fucky. So then Ben plugged in his um, setup for the recordings. Yeah, and then like the power on that side of the room just completely shut off, except for Logan's PowerPoint. Apparently, he yeah. was like, "I've still got power," and I was like. You're the only one. I was sitting like, <laughs> you don't. You don't. <laughs> oh yeah, this is true. He could have just looked at a fully cha- charged laptop and gone, yeah, everything's fine for me. But yeah, so in the busiest locals that we've ever had in a like a long time. Gone. Yeah, like Logan's taken up a table and a half with his laptop and every fucking <laughs> He's like, you could imagine. Everyone come and watch me play Master Duel. <laughs> Yeah, didn't bring his cards. Had no in- yeah, interest in playing. No card, just Literally wanted to just sit in the room and play Master Duel. And, and I hope you're watching. Watch him. It was your fault. He's not watching. You know he's not watching. Someone would have to link him this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I played PK. I enjoyed it. I'm ready for Brave. Hopefully my Brave deck comes either Friday or Monday. And we, I can play it next week. We got the proxies. We, we can do, start. We got the proxies. We can test. Yeah. I was very annoyed at a particular interaction you played against me. Was it the fact that I played like garbage the first two games and then game three I was like, I'm going take it seriously. <laughs> Not that. Like, granted, you was it the very first game? Yeah, I just fucked that completely. Yeah, you completely fucked it. I, you had I, combo and just went, oh, I'm a normal summon this card that gets me the whole way. It's just like that. <laughs> like, it's just, that deck is just like, hey, the thing that's going to ruin everything, do it now. <laughs> <laughs> I, I have my hand and I was like, yeah, this is like some semblance of combo. And like, summon... Like Shade Brigadine was like, yeah, I'm a normal summon this boots now. Yeah, had another level three in hands. Like, that's how it works. This thing that specials itself. I'm gonna use my one summon to get it on board. You don't think Spider for that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see, I did that, but that was all I could do. Yeah. yeah when exactly. I had full combo, yeah. if I special summoned it. Yeah, I was gonna say if you don't link Spider, that's just like. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, it would have been very bad. If no, you make make it bag the pass. <laughs> make that the hope that they pop to the side yeah. you better do something <laughs> and then you better mst it because you haven't crafted cosmic cycle yet. but no the interaction i was um mentioning was the fact that you didn't dag it in your turn which means i couldn't get to the scythe before you popped it with dpe ah, that was yes. very annoying because I, I had I double the, the i had double cosmic in hand and i was so fucking ready for you to set the fucking scythe and then for me to ruin your day and then you're like I your turn it. i was like what I hard nope. opened the fusion destiny, so I did the the play where you go stand by phase, declare DPE, then chain the dagger. Yeah, that triggered me so hard. <laughs> I only sighted in two cosmic, and I saw both, so I was ready if you had like double pop and everything, and you just completely fucked me. I was like, but, but I opened it. <laughs> I beat you. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's that. Um, Bragg, did you do anything this week? You played a lot of Master Duel. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So Which we'll, we'll, we'll merge into that. Yeah. So um, future iterations of this segment after, like, the, like next week, this is going to be Master Jewels probably. Actually, no, next week will be regionals. Yeah, we will be able to talk about regionals because yes. there's one coming up this Sunday, which I may or may not be playing. 
depending on how long it goes. And I keep forgetting to message the store to ask if they're planning on doing like a top cut. Penrith doesn't do top cut. Okay. So if it's five rounds, it starts at 12. I'll be cutting it close. I might have to skip dinner. Skipping the Royal Rumble. Skip dinner. Is the Rumble on, Rumble's on a Monday? Rumble Saturday. Like they do yeah. Saturdays. Yeah. <sighs> like all but two this year are Saturdays. Fuck. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think I'll skip dinner. Okay, skip dinner. <laughs> we'll we're going to a, going to a di- like. the restaurant I don't like anyway, so I don't care. Anyway. Go on see Hamilton. Yeah, that's right. You're like going to ditch like towards yeah. the end. <laughs> it's going to be... Oh. If if you're doing well, though, like say you're 4-0 going into the last round. Oh. 4-0 going into the last round, man, thinks it's Newcastle. But the oh. first act of Hamilton's like really good. It's the second. It's the first half of the second act. That's it's going to get cancelled when you get there. It's a good point. It's a good point. Well, I mean, the thing that I'm coming here for isn't cancelled. Like, if that gets cancelled, I'm like very much in the. What are you coming here for? Um, it, I don't actually. I don't actually know whether you either of you'd know this. Um, because it's very much like a European Australian thing that my friends who are European Australian have invited me to called Sushi Mango. No, oh, it's, no, it's like sushi? No, 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 no. The show is called Sushi Mango. It's like an Instagram comedy thing. Oh. You heard of this, Luke? So they're not making no. sushi flavored no, mango? There's neither sushi or mango. So, then they're making, is it, so it, they at are. the end of the show, do you get mango flavored sushi or sushi flavored mango? You get neither. Why not? It's I... in the fucking title. <laughs> no, no, because sushi is not spelt like sushi. That's a class action. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, that's what I'm coming here for. And if that gets cancelled, fine. Oh, I mean, it's the work. Yeah, it's down there. Well, I think so it's a keep... thrill. No. I thought it was in Sydney at first, and I was like, oh, great, yeah. I'll just duck over the... We're on a complete tangent here. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Well, Brack hasn't had much to talk about in his week of Yu-Gi-Oh! So I thought yeah, we'll 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 in Master Duel section. Let's do it. Um, yeah, my week. Um, yeah, quite a bit of it's been in Master Duel as well. Um, I'm still playing a garbage deck. It's performing less and less well as locals go by. Um, I'm very keen to put something competent together for that regionals because I cannot play this deck and lose after having travelled an hour and a half. What are you going to do when we wake up tomorrow and Alistair's banned? They're going to be banned. <laughs> <laughs> one regional top... No, sorry. One YCS top after five years is not a ban worthy card. I'm sorry, Bragg. Do you have one Meow Meow Mew in your deck? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I do as well. That's an extra deck card. Limit of Macabre Make him yeah, <laughs> to one. No, to zero. What happens if it goes to zero? Well, should all stop playing it? Damn it. Get out of here. Gone. Imagine. Because yeah, right. they don't have another Macabre. really good food. This whole time, I haven't been locked in on the true. It's not even a problem. I like that card. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. People summoning off Nova. Ban that shit. Oh, yeah. So, moving on from our week in Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel is here! By surprise! Wednesday, in our group chat, someone goes, Hey, Master Duel's on Steam. Granted, it wasn't ready on Steam. I was at work and I was like, fuck! I'm going home! (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, I was sitting there stressing too that everyone was just going to start downloading and playing it while I was at work. Turns out it wasn't ready on Steam. It wasn't ready anywhere until like, what, like 8 o'clock, I think? Yeah, just before that, we were going for the pool. Yes. We were going down the pool and Bragg was like, I think it's going to go up at 8. And I was like, I'm going to believe Bragg. Yeah, we'll, come, we'll leave the pool by 8. We're walking down to the pool at 7. Already out. No, but I swear it came out when we got back. Because we got back, it was like 5 to 8. And it still wasn't oh, live on Switch. it was on only Steam. on Switch. Yeah, it was only yeah. live on Switch. Yeah. Because you were playing it on Switch and I was like, it went live on Steam. Apparently it's very delayed on Switch. Like in terms of like being able to press buttons and things that's what Kyra's experience was yeah it's it's not the best Switch game but then again what truly is Tetris 99 yeah it's a really good game <laughs> very, very responsive almost too responsive <laughs> there's too much interaction with the 98 other players Battle Royale and Tetris I've got it yeah um, so what are our initial thoughts on Master Duel so far positives negatives what are we feeling I'm quite enjoying it. That ban list is cracked. 
so good. Like, it, it's degenerous fuck. But I love it. The it's... fact that VFD is still there triggers I am so playing hard. full power <laughs> Gem Knight FTK. Like, not only full power from when I played it, like, back in the day. Just fucking got Adam Emancipators. Here's a Union Carrier. That FTK is so fucking consistent. It... It's it's a it's a weird situation that yeah it's just that point in time in the OCG yeah plus customizations yeah like Dragoon go but Rongo you stay yeah <laughs> it just it's just I can't comprehend the logic of that ban list it was just like what if we just gave everyone two weeks to just fucking run rampant. Yeah. do whatever they want yeah and then we'll police it after that and it's great i think february 1st is when the competitive season resets yeah i think we'll see the ban lists poured in then well but i think someone was saying that there's meant to be a uh data patch around that time as well yeah. right so in theory that's when they start implementing the yeah. regional ban lists i think that's when we'll segment everything will go its own way there'll be separate leaderboards and stuff but yeah, until mm. then it's open season I'm gonna go plat one playing Gem Knight FTK. So you still haven't got that. I'm plat three at the moment. Okay. I have no point have I gone backwards. I just well, haven't had time. We lost yeah. the internet yesterday, so. Oh uh, yeah, there was. Is that. it back up now? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, we have internet. That means you're watching this. <laughs> Woo. Um. Yeah, I'm plat four. And just damn, everyone's on plat. And uh, but uh, there was a point where I got to. Plat four, but with six wins to go. I'm like, I don't know how I've done this. I don't think it's actually possible, but I have lost that much. So I'm back on Elvich. Exactly. I climbed with Elvich and then went, oh, I'm going to swap it up and switch to PK. PK, like, it's a, just 50% win ratio, which just knocks well, me down. You a don't bit. have a Verte package. It is so, it's just so awkward without the Verte one. Like, without that just consistent end goal, like, that's just. What it should, what what the deck's meant to do is yeah. so much easier than, ah, oh, I got to pivot to one of the two extra deck packages I'm running. I've got to decide which one's going to be correct. Could like it's a little bit janky, but could you not do a similar thing with um like a break sword popping the scythe that you've set off? Deck I've up? definitely considered that, yeah. but then just there's a few decks getting around I don't care about extra deck so, like Eldritch. But... <laughs> yeah. So, I, I realised Buster Lock's a thing. Could just do that. Yeah. Good point. Because that was how I learned that Union Carry was still legal in the game. I got Buster Locked and I was like, is it legal? <laughs> you saw the Union Carry pop out, you're like, what the fuck are you doing here? I'm a guaranteed Lock Dragon every turn. <laughs> Let's go. You and Plat, yeah. No, I've not had that. Well, actually, that's not entirely true. I have had time to play. Not as much time as others, because like, my entire Saturday was wiped out because of a wedding. Um, the other thing is too, I'm enjoying solo mode a lot. Like, I've done so much on solo mode. Like, mainly to I'm grind like... gems. I've wanted the gems, and it just occurred to me how I actually get gems in solo mode. So I'm doing that a lot. Like, I I've gotten think... like 12 or 1400 free gems just for doing more stuff in solo mode. I think total in solo mode you get like 28. It's, like, it's a lot of gems. It is a lot of gems for doing stuff that's fun anyway. And it's not even like you have to use the loner decks to do that. Like, I realised quite late on that there's two different options once you pass, like, the practice thing. Yeah. That you can use the loner deck, which is generally fucking trash. Oh, what, what, one of the loner decks is really bad. Yeah. It was um, the Gym Knight one. Yeah, oh, yeah the Gym Knight one. The loner deck shit. you get given is the inferior deck of the two, and I just got fucking smoked. And I was like, I know Gem Knight's inside and out, and this loner deck is fucking trash. I got World Legacy, like I was doing the World Legacy lore bit, and there was a bit where like you're playing effectively pure World Legacy, where you're just like summoning vanillas and doing links off that. To get you to link materials, what they decided was a great way to get more normal monsters was to add Paleo. But not Dynamicious, not the good one, just the flip one, the spell and trap pop one. It's like, I don't want to link summon on turn three. I want to link summon on turn one. I want to link summon now. I want to put a monster on the board now. It was so fucking annoying. But anyway, I got past that bit eventually. And then someone told me, it's just like, oh yeah, you have the option of choosing your own deck. I was like, 
Fuck yeah. Man, man thought when it said cleared, he'd finished it. Didn't say complete. Well, that, that did dawn on me pretty early on. I was looking down and I was like, how come these ones only say clear? But I wasn't doing like the top branch, so I assumed it was just the top branch. Someone died outside. Yeah. Um, That's a fatality. Yeah. Moment of silence. We move. Anyway. Yeah, so um, yeah, so I'm really enjoying solo mode, grinding that to get some more gems, and I've not really put together like any well, like good decks really. Like I've put together pure mech, which is fine. I haven't gone to the extent of putting together the um, hand loop yet, but that will be coming eventually. Um, mainly because I pulled pot of, pot of prosperity, and that's like essential for that to be able to find your gisu, because um, it's not possible without gisu. You need to pa open Gisu, or you don't get to do it. Pot of Prosperity as a super rare. Oh yeah, that's so br When I realised it was a super, I was like, oh, oh, I can do this. This is a thing I can this do. This is significantly cheaper than real life. Oh yeah, like I couldn't dream of buying, like, a set of prosps at the moment. How much time does it take to do the solo mode to get the 2800 coins? Probably a lot. It's probably as much as you'd be spending to get to like plat six on your thing. But in saying that, it's a lot easier because A you're versing an AI and B you're using decks that you already have built. Yeah. So you're not having to use their janky loaners. Yeah. Some of those loaners are like, yeah, there's loaners. Yeah. The Mech Knight one was fucking atrocious as like they're like, oh yeah, all the Mech Knights are level seven. You know what likes level sevens? Earth's Arctic. So but the second you start doing things with Earth's Arctic, you can't summon non-level monsters, so you can't use the Earth's Arctics to link. It's fucking retarded. They don't want you to link. They I want to, to link. They can real life. Fuck no. I, th I feel like that was just their thing of like trying to sell it to people that don't know any better. It's just like, hey, you know Mech Knights? You, They're good with Earth's Arctic. You played in bronze. Yeah. Oh yeah. My bronze experience was just a bunch of absolute brain dead idiots, and I was like, okay. Sure. Yeah, I'll get to the, like that's <laughs> that's definitely even a thing. even in gold. I had an Eldritch play a fucking solemn judgment their own skill drain. <laughs> I was like, they okay. changed their mind. They're like, wait, <laughs> actually, no, I have I effects I want to activate. And I was no. like, okay, <laughs> I'm gonna burn you for the rest of that damage. It actually, what's that? A thousand... Yeah, so they put themselves on thirty five effectively yeah, if they hadn't taken damage. Before. Two shots. Love yeah, that. I I think he had a gold lord board, so it was one shot. <laughs> it yeah it's such a deep end thing for newer players or returning players it's I don't know what they were thinking but I, I think there's like a, there's a good portion of people that are just playing it on um in their own jewel rooms and stuff I looked at the jewel rooms and there's heaps of on my computer it doesn't say that's available yet yeah on mine as well it doesn't say that I can do out. that it says oh. I can't do it cause yeah so you can get into rooms by being invited I don't yeah know, but so that must be just for the switch then. Maybe there's like because yeah, you can because you can search up room code and stuff. Yeah, oh, I swear I did on PC as well. Mine's just grayed out. It says coming soon. Mm. Yeah, mine too. Same with the events tab, which would be very interesting yeah. to see what Same. kind of events they do. Apparently they'll be doing events, but you have to literally sit there for the entire tournament. Oh. Yeah, so you can't do anything if you like lose. You have to like wait for your next round of tournament. Well, we'll see how that goes. Um. The pack system is weird. I've, I've gotten the hang of it now. I really like it. I I like the idea of it, but like I would like it if there was a bit more separation of packs. I would like, like maybe it. seven to eight packs to choose from. Because like if you look at the breakdown of what's in what pack, it's like this pack has 80. This pack has 80. This pack has 6,725. Yeah. To eight. be fair, I th so I think it's all... Of, so of those... Secret packs you open. What is it? Nine cards per pack. Eight. Eight. Eight, eight, eight and it's four and four. Yeah. So four cards will be from that pack. Four cards will be from the entire pool from of the pool. Year. From the pool. Yeah. Yeah. Which is actually a pretty cool way to do packs, I guess. I Where like you, it. You sprinkle in. I just wish there was a way to get hand traps. Like more efficiently in packs like there are some that are available in the secret packs but the bulk of them aren't yeah like you can get Nibiru I think of the alien one get something from, come mm, from another planet I don't want to do the alien one though I'll probably yeah that's the it. that's the thing yeah. is like some of the pairings of like what they put together is like 
I don't want any of the other shit. I just want I just want this. The thing that you have like, featured on the packet, I just want that. The Dragon Maids are with the Starry Knights, and I was like, <laughs> why? <laughs> I was like, let's uh, all these Starry Knights, they're getting cried, they're getting broken down. Oh, I had the vampire the stuff from. Which when mates playing um, vampires instead, I'm like, if you're playing vampires, you would have pulled the old stuff too. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> you're playing the wrong zombie! <laughs> What do you do? Eldritch. It's. That's it's a recipe for trouble in best of one. In what? What do you mean? Well, <laughs> like just like. You always have the same game plan, pretty much. Like I feel like Eldritch gets screwed by overcommitted extra decks. So, you have to main those spell and trap cards in a in a ladder where there's also just random combo decks running around. So. Are you playing triple evenly. I mean, I assume you are. I'm not. Oh. I'm, I'm literally just playing I don't give a fuck what you put on your board. I'm yeah. just going to combo. Yes, yeah, true. Um, so yeah, that's the thing. So you either have to play the evenlies or you have to get those lightning storms. Like, it feels and it feels super bad. So I think Eldritch picks up a few wins there because of the best of ones. Are best of ones here to save for ladder? I kind of hope so because if my dueling book experience is anything to go by I get very bored after like one best of three yeah what if they just kept this current ban list situation they're doing and just had that as the best of one ladder I wouldn't hate that I I, quite like it like the theory is at the moment like we said that they're going to reset as of February 1st have the OCG TCG list whatever Mm. in theory Ryan you could have this list just be permanent for Master Duel. Because by doing so, it gives people different routes, and it means they don't have to be like, oh, I'm already playing this in this, why would I play the other? Yeah. It means that people can freely play both. Yeah. And it feels different either way. You also, like, somewhat dodge those, that player base that's like, my cards got banned, never playing this again. Yeah. It's like, Guess what? Here's this warped as fuck format. Have it. Do you want to play triple max scene in FTK? Off you go. This is the other thing that got brought up in the chat today as well. What do they do in terms of a ban list? Especially like if it is the case that February 1 they go to a reset, people have bought into all these cards that they literally can't play in the main set. You're a fucking idiot if you like bought into all that shit. That's what I thought. That's my mentality. Like, I only bought one call. <laughs> <laughs> like, I've only bought one call by the grave. Yeah. Like, realistically, all you've gotten is three skip frame. That's the, like, money card in your deck that's not really going to be in the TCG format. And the maxis. And the maxis, but you can play a TCG format and they find that. That's the thing, yeah. So that's the the going idea would be is, hey, I'm probably going to play a TCG format a little bit. So if they yeah. do, everything I've invested in is still at the, the number I invested. Like, I've got them at in both formats. Yeah. So... You just get to pick up one more Eld Land, and then you got your TCG format deck sorted. Yeah, I'm not sure if I'll. We'll see. And then even what happens with like if we do get Burst of Destiny or Braves, and we could very well get that on February first as well. They could just be like, yeah, that's true. That could just be the data patch. They very well, could just release a patch and be like, here is the finished version of this game because currently, effectively, we're playing a beta. Yeah. Like, we are beta testing at the moment. It's a two-week period of us just seeing what we can break. And to be fair, not a lot's breaking. Yeah, I've not seen a huge amount of issues. Like, there was a couple of issues I saw that, like, random images would appear in your hand of, like, extra <laughs> and To be like fair, that. I've only seen that on Lachlan's. I'm yet to see that be reproduced by anyone. That's fair. Is, is it true that you've also only seen it on Lachlan's? Yeah, I've only seen or heard of it from Lachlan. Right? Mm-hmm. Maybe it's not the game. <laughs> Maybe it's Lachlan's device. Um, I'm, do you think it'll do it a Hearthstone be... thing for the cards? Sorry to butt in. No, yeah. It probably is his like, 30-year-old Xbox system that's like yeah. got <laughs> bugs laden within it, both literal and digital. So do you think they... Are, even though people... You, the people at home, are idiots for buying... <laughs> Three maxis. Do you think they they could entertain a refund system? Not a refund system, but like the Hearthstone like 
You just get the tickets for what's banned. No. That'll be like break it down. Get your tame gems. They've given you a refund system. It's called Thiecraft. Like we, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. Break down. Yeah. I suppose you're never effectively going to get the money you spend on anything back. So to ask for a refund on cards that realistically you knew weren't going to be staying is not likely. And it does open them up to the fact of like in the real world, like, oh, are you going to give me something for the fact that you banned my Protoss? Yeah. No. Because you're an asshole. Ask Harry. Harry has a lot of uh, <laughs> yeah, Harry, history. Harry this. would make millions if that system were in play. Yeah, we'll see. I don't think they're going to do it either. No. But. Only the prison's there. Time. What's next on the topic? That Tonight. is a great question. The next topic is. Uh, the Remote Dual YCS. I believe this was Utrecht? Was it Utrecht? Well, yeah, well, that's what they changed it from, right? Yes. It is now. Oh, that's right. It no longer has yeah. a place. It's just European YCS. European Remote Dual YCS. To Part two. Red and trade. Fucking red and trade. It's four months to send my goddamn prizing. No, six six months. Six. Have you got your prizing? I got it eventually. Not a fucking ultra or secret in any of my packs. Same. Fucking bullshit. I'm not playing that though. But anyway, we have uh, the top thirty-two breakdown. We have nine Sword Soul Ten Year. Uh, eight Lyrilus Try. Three Drytron. Two Sky Striker. <coughs> Excuse you. Uh, two Fluandui, two B Trooper, two Tri Brigade DPE, uh, one Phantom Knight, one Dragon Link, one Invoke Dogma, and one Prank Kids. One Invoke Dogma? Just one. Dude, dude pulled his weight. Yeah, he was he was carrying hard. Uh, with the winner recorded here as Sword Soul. Yeah. What? That's what it says. Oh, that was that. Okay, I paid attention to the other YCS. Yeah. Because I saw Simon he won this YCS. So I was like. Disregard. <laughs> uh, so since it was a remote jewel, do you think there were nefarious tactics? That's on the record. That's what I heard. Without having watched it, I actually... Lawyers, no Ben knows sold that. I have no indication of where he lies on the matter. What did he even do? He's, he was like the nail scratcher, yeah? Yeah, apparently it was marked cards from what I heard. Yeah. <laughs> There's video evidence. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't know why we're, like, allegedly... Oh, we're ale it's allegedly for this event. But, yeah. like... We have oh, video evidence of the previous. Oh, is it a different guy? Oh, I thought it was this guy. Okay. No, so this guy... Sorry, no, Simon. Guy. Oh, it is this guy? No, no yeah, Fuck yeah, you, yeah. Simon. <laughs> <laughs> ah, he's not watching this. He's in jail. <laughs> Konami, actually, not even Konami job. That's what, and that's what's so weird is there's people where it's just like, imagine just waltzing back into the game after being banned for uh, he was banned for like five years. Yeah, he got a long term ban. Oh, I understand where you're coming from now. Okay, yes, yes, yes. yes yeah, yes. he was banned for years. Yeah, okay. Because he received his ban in 2013, came back in 2018, got banned again. No, no, no. Oh, he's just been playing for a while. Oh, okay. But he's been keeping it under the radar, but now that he's won, everyone's like, No, hey. he's been doing, like, decent, but every time I see he's topped an event, I'm just like, disregard. Yeah, it does kind of stain your reputation forever, doesn't it? Because it's like, yep. yeah, sure, you might have won this one legit. Especially when you like, win a remote duel. It's like, hmm. Yeah, which is, like, prolific for like, cheating. You'd assume that Konami has to, like, treat everything as in, so they can't single him out and be like, you know what, we're going to do, like, a proper deck check on you. Because, like, what are you going to do? Hold up your fucking 720p camera and be like, Bleh. they're all the same. Check it. Yeah, it's kind of fucky, like, the amount of shit that people can try and get away with. Um, but yeah, um, th well, there was some other event that, like, someone was whinging that invoked one. There was the North America YCS Part 2. Part 2? It's, it's really fucking confusing what they've done. So it was the second half of the YCS they had, like, a month ago. But oh, they had another YCS yeah. in the middle. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, right. Because that's what they originally did for the one that they let Australia enter, right? They had two separate, Correct. like, sections. They did, effectively, the top cut, like, another three weeks after. 
I'm sorry I led you astray when I put it in the show notes. I thought there was only one YCS this weekend. Well, so did I. And then when I saw that Sold Soul won, I was like, I swear someone was at me that Alice was going to get banned because he invoked one an event after five years. <laughs> Maybe it was invoked Sword Soul. <laughs> no, I saw the list. You invoked Sword Soul. <laughs> Fucking Jesus. Um, so, yeah, that covers the YCSs. Um, don't at me about Alistair. Um, we have. At him intensely. Fuck off. Uh, we have more news about the rarities from Grand, Grand Creators. I, I remember was right. <laughs> I was 100% correct as to what the remaining cards were. Yeah, we, we all kind of assumed that it was based on what we knew. Uh, but basically, you've got three punk cards, three Exor Sisters, uh, one, two... Yeah, the three Braves we knew. Three Braves with, that we already knew. The two Insector cards that we already knew. Although, I do remember them saying that... The, oh, wait, is that... They hadn't confirmed Dragonfly and Hornet, but it was... I do remember seeing them on the list that we read through that, oh. that it was Dragonfly and Hornet, but yeah. I thought their spell was getting one as well. It, it, it is. It is? Is that it's, it then? It's the, no, it's the last one. It's not on this list. Oh. It's definitely one of them. You reckon? Yep. No, there's 15 cards there, though. 3, 6, 9... Wait... Three, six. It's not 15 cards here. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, no, it's only 14. Yeah, so that's it, the last one? Yeah. Whoever made this... Um, Carl Lancho's store. Carl Lancho's store. Which count. is Spanish, but they have a koala as their logo. Don't steal our animals. We don't steal your Spaniards. That's probably the least offensive thing we could have said. Well done. I did um, a lot of <laughs> um, But then, yeah, the other card that we um, suspected would be what wasn't confirmed at the time was e -Telly, Which is hot. For some reason, so people good. bought out the Ultra e -Telly. Yeah. It's 3am it and there's like a large mob of people outside, clearly. The people who bought e um, <laughs> yeah, <they're laughs> they have taken the streets. <laughs> They've taken the streets and riots. Why would you buy the Ultra? It's icky. There's also like other ultras. I want the common. Wait, is it? Is it it's really? A rare, it's a rare. <sighs> gonna have so many lying around. It's gonna be so great. Man, do we have an Italy? Yeah, we have an Italy. Oh yeah, we do. <laughs> Just like I have like seventeen thousand pots of desires. Yeah, nightmare that's so good. I, know, I don't have to look for pot of desires ever again. I'm just like, oh shit! If I'm you lost just organise your shit, you wouldn't lose anything. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna employ your um, efforts one day. You don't want me touching your shit. No, I'm gonna. I figured out a way. I'm gonna organize my cards. Generations. So DM, GX thingy thingy thingy. That takes so That's much organization. Take Holy time. shit! Just go but, alphabetical, bro. No. But then all of them are mixed up. And I like my generations idea. That's gonna take five years. It's gonna take five years. That's and why get, I need you. And it'll get ruined in minutes. You're invited minutes. too if you want. I've got my own book to sort. Yeah, I still have my own. I was going to sort it over the week. That's a good point, actually. You've been in this game for a while now, so that bulk's going to be getting there. I want to yeet some of it, to be honest. Like, when I look through my commons in particular, because of what I <laughs> because of what I was buying early on, like, so much of it was jank, and I've got, like, 17 copies of a shit common, and I'm just like, I need to get rid of these, just yeah. so I can free up some space. Um, but anyway, in terms of the exciting stuff, that's all we really need to know. The rest of it's kind of simple. Three of the Exorcisters are Ultras, three of the No Punks are Ultras, Mm. Um, three, uh, one of the Insectors, yeah, it's three of each of the Archetypes and the Insector spell, Ultra, simple. To be um, fair, that's still three of the, you get two Insectors, or is that your Ultras? I don't worry. Yeah, these are Supers. Okay, don't worry. These ones here, yeah, yeah, which yeah. no one cares about. Cool. Um, actually Super Centipede, is it Super, Super Centipede? Centipede? Uh, no, that's Dragonfly. No, just Dragonfly. I'm gonna say, what's Centipede again, ignored again? Actually, Actually no, the, the first old, like, OTS the Insector Link hasn't had a super yet, has no. it? Okay. Well, because the super's gonna be nice. Because well, I was expecting it to be like secret in the Mega Tins and it wasn't. It's disappointing. Big Sag. The brave prices though for those ultras feel still still feels bad. Uh, are there any other I haven't paid for Brave. Remember last week when we were discussing the podcast that we were gonna buy Brave? Oh did we buy Brave already at that point? We had bought Brave. I already. think you'd both bought Brave and you're like, yeah, we needed to do it, it's gonna be expensive. From what you were about to say, I feel like you We overpaid a little. I overpaid a little. I don't know. No, I, no, I paid the same as you. Okay, we overpaid a little, this but is... okay. It's from a a buyer that could deliver promptly. So yes, 
Hopefully we will have that delivered. I I realised that I got it delivered to my parents' house. And so, fuck. AIDS. Um, the other thing that um, you mentioned after the pod last week is that with this set at least, there was no waves. Yes. It was yeah. all just available. Everyone received their, their shipment allotments. Everyone got everything they ordered. I wonder if that's just a sign of the times that like, oh, actually, we don't need to do waves anymore because our product printing is consistent or whether they're just like, oh, this particular run is good. The rest of them will be shit. There's a general belief that it was ordered less by major retailers. Interesting. Yeah. Do you think in response to the waves bit of like ordering X amount of product in the being told, maybe you can have this much now? Could be. Yeah, I suppose I'd, that's something I didn't consider last time, is like, sure, the distributors can say, oh, well, you have waves, you can have this much now, this much later, and this much later on. But then if people are getting a second wave, and by that point people have bought their singles and what they need elsewhere, they've got product they can't sell. Yeah. That's always been the mentality from the start of Konami. You'd literally just turn around and be like, you know what? Go fuck yourself. And now it's a case of... Uh, They've got to turn no, it. No, no, fuck you! Please keep ordering our card game. Please. <laughs> yeah, I thought vendors would go above, and like there would almost be no limit to what they would order. No. Hmm. Is, they like to cap themselves, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like they like try and keep a shortage in the market so that they can justify higher prices. The last thing you want is having another. Uh, what was it? Dimensionals, whatever. Dimensional Guardians. Oh. That the set that literally no one bought. Which one I was Dimensional Guardians. Exactly. Or was it was it Ancient Guardians? You mean? No, no, no. no, no, no. Dimensional, Dimensional Guardians. Guardians was the last Duelist pack before they changed it to oh, Legendary. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I feel like Sisters of the Rose fucked that long before anything else. Like, this was l- before Sisters of the Rose. Sisters of the uh, Rose is great. How dare you? It was bad. The set was bad, and you should feel bad. No, it's fine. I got the train. The the only thing worth it yeah, in that great. set was the Lunar Light. Um, trap Wrong. because people needed that in lunar light harpy's feather storm it already had the reprint yeah a reprint a print that you would feel comfortable uh, taking home to your parents yes we all know that do not is... that ugly do so hey guys yeah. i have a harpy's card get the fuck out of my house Just anyway. like he was there <laughs> <laughs> Um, next we have shoutouts. Oh, um, we're, we're down to our comments, yeah. Shout out to Dr. Hypersonic, who I... congratulated me on my, uh, top yeah, 16. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know, it... I don't know what a top 16, <laughs> sorry, Dr. Hypersonic, I top 8 in, he, um, Yeah, I was gonna say, um, he came second, like, top 16 original. feels like a bit of a demotion from literally I, coming second place. I'm, I'm, Dr. Hypersonic, comment below what you thought. It was because you said you liked the XEs I was playing. Ah. This also confused me because I was like, You were playing Sword Soul. Playing Sword what Soul, yeah. XZs do you run in Sword Soul? You confused me. Get back to me on that. I thought you had some like sneaky tech to like search yourself a um, token collector or some shit. Then I was like, That doesn't work either. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. jump on our Discord. Yes, link will be in the description. Feel free to jump in and explain yourself. You're already there for the rest of you. Also leave your comments down below if you have any questions. The rest, yeah, the rest of the comments and questions from the YouTube. Yes. Uh, so we have uh, Rocket Launcher. The Secret World of Alex Max is the show. Mac is the show you were thinking of, uh, which Bragg alluded to like several days later. I saw the like poster for it and I was like, yes, that's the one where the chick turns into Mercury. <laughs> well, because uh, I had said, like, I had said, oh, Jake was talking about a show to Brit. And she's actually just about to call up. Um, and she's I right away said it. I'm like, oh, I did. It. Yeah, it doesn't surprise me that she like immediately knew. Hey, um, but yeah, that was um, something that I was very happy to learn because it was like bugging me for a while. I might say the next one. Yeah, Nicholas Smith. Because I I, ta- I took this personally. <laughs> it kind I, I, it dug in deep as I was going into originals. Um, believe me. Playing, been playing PK for a year now. There's still things I'm discovering with the strat. You'll never find out everything in three days. I always find that in tight three days. I didn't. <laughs> wow. Okay. Hold Mister. on. Did you say you fucked yeah, up the combo? You fucked up real bad earlier tonight. Nah, so don't I be. Fuck it off. I did it exactly how I intended to do it. 
I just we wanted have... to lower the ceiling to DPE. Just, I just wanted we to... We have you on recording going, <laughs> do I special or normal? Special or normal? I want normal. Nah, it was just... I fucked up. It was all for the banter. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it was all to give me the win of that particular game, but not the match. Um, Nicholas, if you want to send any more personal advice, I'm up for it. It was a, it was a hard truth that I read on a Friday night going into the regionals. And it's one that I realised. I thought you were, I thought that was coming from after the regional. No, it's like the so this was before okay. and then I didn't read the comments till today. Okay. <laughs> Perfect advice. Oh yes, I've already failed at the event. Thank you very much. <laughs> um next we have Spites Cadet. I'm imagining that's how that's pronounced. Yeah. Um the pendulum cards can probably come off from being banned, unlimited or limited. Except Electromite, I guess. Correct. Lachlan's gonna find you. Oh, we, got the... we could get Electromite back with that new archetype. Yeah, it's another opportunity for Konami to unban it. Will they take it? No. Probably not. Pendulums really pendulums aren't really doing much on the um on ladder. Like they're there. They do some stuff. I feel like people are just resisting the FTK build in which they could just decimate. Yeah, I don't know why. All like, the FTKs are there. Just do them. It's Might okay well. to be degenerate. The format's going to get demolished in a couple days anyway. Just be degenerate. Nah. That loose. Like a goose. Um, one of our IRL fans, well, I don't know if it's our fan, he's definitely yours. Uh, Ender plays. Stupid aircon not working half the time. It's not even working now. Did we switch it off, or is it just not working? I don't know. Bragg's looking at it quite forlornly. Who, who knows anymore? It does what it wants. <laughs> uh, and then the last comment, uh, Jay Mikhail. This guy is still it's starting Jerome. to really annoy me. Yeah. Um, that guy is me. So if Jerome's you... not you. Wait, are you Jerome? Did no. he just admit to it? He just admitted to being Jerome. It's, Head of Konami. It is I. Alistair's never getting banned. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. This, it's a reference to me, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Uh, maybe. Yes. We need a Scooby-Doo this I've shit. also been in the video, I, in the other video he was slandering you on, I was in the background eating a kebab. No, he wasn't slandering him in that video, he was talking positive about the no, video. Oh, uh, yeah, in, yeah, in that one where you're eating the sandwich behind me, that was where he's like, this is a lovely gentleman who must be so I still think as a... Unless he's looking at you and going, that man going to town on the sandwich <laughs> looks really delightful. Kebab. It's a kebab. Important distinction for Ben's viewers. Yes. It was kebab. I just want that on the record. I don't think international viewers know what a kebab town. is. Do I... they have kebabs elsewhere? Don't be racist. Do you? Comment it down below. It's not not shish kebabs. We're talking Skewers. Like, not those. Talking like the rap. It wasn't actually... The reason why I demolished it so quick, it wasn't that hefty. I could have gone into town on a hefty one, though. I was pretty hungry. This is the darkest timeline. <laughs> uh, so back... I still think there's a 3% chance the guy was me. And that... Jerome is calling me out. Three percent. But then he commented on a dual video, being like, oh. nah, "Now I hate this dude." Wait on his, on his one. Yeah, on a yeah. He video. watched a replay of mine. Uh, was I versing you? Was, yeah. was it? Yeah, I was versing you. It's when I was cooking. Uh, yeah, you were fucking playing crag and control, and somehow I was the bad guy in that. Fucking. I was nice. I took away my crook my cook lock. So the profile photo of this person, who we're fairly sure is fake. Um, that's the head of Konami. It's the head of Konami. It's his name. It's like a picture of his face. No, the head of Konami personally hates you. He's banning Mechaba tomorrow at 6 p.m. Uh, what is the head of the game? Just dropped. I haven't seen the chat blow up, so I'm assuming not. There's been a time in the past where the ban list has dropped immediately after the podcast. Yeah, we've usually gone home about that point and gone like, fuck. <laughs> well, it was the night that Seb was sleeping here, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, and we got him up. It was yeah. so good. We so miss yeah, you, Seb. No, no ban list yet, but hopefully soon. The ban list drops through the night. You're okay to wake me. Yeah, get me on the... No, he's getting jealous. We, get have me... to put, we have to put him here on like a Yeah, phone I was going to say, just have me on, on like I'll a turn my FaceTime. i around, just have it. Yeah, have it on a FaceTime call. Yeah, just put me on a FaceTime call. Sure. I'll happily do that. Um, but yeah... Po like pending any ban list coming through in the next 10 seconds that is it for uh this week's episode feel free to jump in the comments below uh let us know about your thoughts of master duel uh the format in general ban list predictions yeah especially ban list predictions get them in what are you playing in master duel at the moment 
yeah, comment down below what your sort of favourite deck to play is at the moment, uh, what you're enjoying most about it as well. Um, and then join our Discord as well. Feel free to chat with some people there. There's been some bants about um, us all in there as well. Um, but until next week, see you later.